Hello guys, welcome to my YouTube. Um, well, welcome to Lizzie Makeup. Today we're going to do a makeup video on something new. L'Oreal Infallible 24 Hour Fresh Wear. So this is a new foundation from L'Oreal. That's in some drugstores, not all, but some. So this um, foundation, it's supposed to be a 24 hour fresh wear foundation. It's supposed to be um, breathable texture and um, medium coverage. It has sunblock and it has 24 hour wear. So let's see how this goes. This is supposed to be, I guess, in between um, luminous and pro match, just like a regular foundation. It's not like matte or luminous. It's supposed to be right in the middle. People say, some people say it's matte, some people say it's not. So we're gonna give it a try. I have very oily skin. I'm not gonna put a lot of stuff on my skin. I'm just gonna put my regular, um, like a little primer. Not even a great primer, just like a little drugstore primer. I'm gonna put on a little bit of powder. I'm gonna put on a little bit of things. And I'm gonna see how, how it wears. So now guys, I'm gonna put my little headband on so I can start putting on my stuff. Give me one sec. All right, guys, I'm ready for my video. I put my little headband down, and I'm ready to do my little makeup and show you guys how this thing works for oily skin like mine. So now I have to bring my setting spray, bring some powder, I have to bring my little brush cleaner, I have to bring some stuff with me. It's probably things that I need. So I make not all my stuff, obviously, because that would be a try to date to bring all this stuff with me, but a few things. So first, guys, we're going to use my little primer. It's not, like, the best primer I have, but it's, like, a drugstore primer. It's called Soap and Glory One Heck of a Blot Primer. So we're going to use this one. And in the background, guys, I'm watching The Real Housewives of Dallas. Yeah. So if you hear some girls screaming and yelling and fighting, it's the bitches, mommy. Okay? All right. Now back to this. So I put some of my little primer here. Here we go. People, like, really enjoy my videos. I'm happy that you guys get to watch my videos because I really enjoy making them. And I like people who like my videos. Now, if you have any negative opinions about my videos, just keep them to yourself, okay? Or if you have something constructive criticism, I take it. I like that kind of stuff because it helps me become a better person. But mean people, no, it's not good. But yeah, anyway, this is my little primer that I wear sometimes. You know, I want to be quick and fast, and there it is. So now, guys, we're going to go right into the foundation. The foundation. Now let's see if I match good with this thing, because you never know, guys. So this is the colors. This color is 45 some beige. So I don't know if the color is dark enough for me. We're gonna find out right now. What do you guys think about this color? Good? Let's see. Yeah, it's good. I like the color, it's nice. I think I need one more little pumpy, and then we'll be good to go. This is where my skin eats most of the foundation right here, so I put my foundation here because it eats the crap out of foundation there. I don't know what the hell, but you're really hungry. But that's where it goes. All right, guys. Let me use my brush. All right, guys. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to apply my foundation. So I'm going to... It looks very nice. It looks like a nice, fresh foundation. It looks like it covers in a nice, fresh way. It doesn't, it doesn't look cakey at all. It looks nice and natural. This is a very pretty foundation. I like it. This foundation is very nice. I like it. It gives me like a little tan, a little glow. 
That looks supernatural. It does not look cakey. It does not look like anything crazy. It looks very natural. It looks like I don't even have foundation on, actually, to be honest with you. That's what it looks like. I think I'm almost done with my foundation application. Okay. All right, guys, I'm done putting the foundation on. I put all my foundation on. So just take a look at my face. The foundation is very fresh. It's very nice. It's not heavy at all. It looks very natural. It just like gives you an even skin tone, but it's very natural, very fresh, not cakey. It's very nice. It's definitely gonna be like um, Jeffree Star approved, and he love that kind of foundation. I think because it makes you look pretty and alive, and you know that kind of stuff. Well, guys, I'm gonna finish my foundation. No, my, my foundation's on, obviously. I'm gonna finish my makeup to make myself look a little bit less flat. Even though it doesn't look flat, it looks actually nice. This is a foundation you can wear by itself outside and you don't look flat because it looks so natural that it doesn't look like you have any foundation on. So you can probably wear this out and go outside and you won't look flat. Like, you don't need to wear like blush and all that stuff. But I'm gonna probably maybe try to put a little blush on. But I think that basically you can put this on and um, go outside just like this because it's not flat because it looks so natural that it's not flat at all. Okay, guys, so I'm gonna finish up my makeup and I'll be back in two minutes. See you soon. Hi guys, I'm back. My makeup is all done. Everything's done, everything's good. This is what the foundation looks like. Very natural, very pretty, very, very, very nice. I am so impressed. Like, it's ridiculous. This place was gonna be like, you know, all right, but like, I was gonna not like it that much. It was gonna be a little oily for me, and I was gonna be like, wow, because I have oily skin like crazy. But I like it. It holds its own. It's on my skin. It's on there. And it feels like I have nothing on my face. That's what I love about it. I can go to sleep right now and I will never know I have makeup on. I mean, I have to take it off obviously before I go to sleep. So what I'm going to do for you guys is, right now it is, let me see. Hold on. Right now it is 6-11. 6-11. At, before I go to bed tonight, before I remove this makeup tonight, I will um, touch up with you guys and tell you guys how my makeup looks. Because it looks beautiful right now. Look at it. But I don't know how it's going to look later. So I will touch up for my oily girls and let you guys know if it's going to hold its own with our oily girls or if it's going to go down. If it's going to look better or not. I'll let you guys know that later. And so um, I really want to know if in a few hours, like in four or five hours, it's still going to look like this or it's going to get oily. I would love to know that. And I will let you guys know that later on before I go to sleep. I'll see you guys later. And I hope this foundation holds its own because I really love the way it looks. So if it holds its own, I will, I will love it forever. Right now, I love the L'Oreal Pro Matte. This is the L'Oreal Infallible, the regular. Not luminous, not Pro Matte, just the regular one. And I like it because it's fresh. It's the fresh one. So I like because it, fe it feels like a fresh face. Like it doesn't feel like it's like a lot of stuff on your face. It doesn't feel like you have anything on. It looks and feels very nice and you know very natural. So I would love it if this one could last forever. Like it says 24 hours. That would be amazing. So we'll find out later. See you girls later, or my my loves later. It is 10:22. So it's been a few hours, like four or five or whatever, four or whatever. So I just want you guys to look at the makeup and see how it looks. So I'm gonna go to sleep in a little bit, so I'm gonna take it off. I'm not gonna go to sleep right now, but I'm gonna take it off because I have to like, you know, take a shower, get ready for bed, get my pajamas on, watch some TV, chill a little bit, relax, you know? So um, I think the, the foundation held up really good, as you can see. Um, take a little look at it. It looks probably very similar to the way it looked when we put it on, which was a few hours ago. And I have super oily skin, and it hasn't gotten oily. You know, it's funny, it gets get really oily, and they get like oily and like nasty, and like you can just rub it around. Like, let's do a test. How about that? Let me get a little my hand. Let's try my hand. All right, guys, for the test, I'm gonna use the Ulta Green Tea Blotting Paper Kit. 
which is this. I took it from my daughter. <laughs> but I want to try to see if any of the oil or like makeup sticks on it. All right, see how it is. So here it is, guys. And it has its own little thing that you can use to put it on. It's so cute. I love it. Okay, let's try it. And what? It's not, I mean, there's a little bit of oil in there because obviously I'm human and I breathe and shit. But other than that, it's nothing really there, guys. This is not much oil or makeup that has been removed from my face for hours of makeup. It's been applied on my face. I've ran, I've ate, I've picked up my room, I've cleaned up the house. I've done a lot of shit in four hours or five hours. Um, but this is all it took off my face. That's it. And just so you guys know, this is the um, Ulta Green Tea Blotting Paper Kit. And it brings like 50. It's very cute. Because it like sticks on this thing. And there's like a little like thing you can just put on your face. It's adorable. It has a little mirror inside. It's very cute. But yeah, guys. So it didn't take off a lot of makeup. Which means it's the makeup stays on your face. Basically, this is the whole idea that I'm trying to tell you. A little bit of oil was on my face. Okay, I'm a human. It happens. And um, what else, guys? So, yeah, my makeup, I think I really like it. I think that whenever I'm going to look natural, pretty, like, natural, like, I don't want to, like, I have a lot of makeup on, or I'm going, like, get, like, like, you know, I don't want to, like, be greasy or, like, nasty or, like, do I look, like, full glam? I could wear this, and I could look nice, natural, and pretty. So, and it, it does last really good. So, and it, the cost of the, of the um, makeup was um, $14.99, I believe. So it's not a pricey like foundation or anything like that and it's lizzie approved so yeah i approved that makeup um so that's the l'oreal infallible 24 hour wear and that it's really good i really liked it good job l'oreal and um any oily people who want to wear it if i can wear it you can wear it because i have the worst oily skin like only the problem i have with my skin is that it gets oily as hell so i have to like this is why I wear makeup because my makeup keeps it from getting oily sometimes because if I just keep my skin like that with no moisturizer or nothing it gets oily as hell so I have to put moisturizer so my skin can relax keep it tamed keep it calm yeah well anyways guys this is the end of the video everything went well the L'Oreal infallible is awesome that's the fresh one because they have infallible pearl matte infallible luminous infallible this infallible that this is the infallible fresh 24 hour foundation number 485 so if my foundation twinsies i'm 485 so if everyone has my complexion or like my color at all 485 is sun beige i believe but it says 485 on the front so 485 matches me if you're a 42 nc in mac that's what i am 42 nc nc 42 whatever nc 42 in mac then that would be a 485 it's exactly matches me like nothing is not like a little lighter a little darker it's perfectly my color so yeah well, you guys have a good night. I hope you guys enjoyed my video. See you next time. And I'm so sorry that um, I haven't been on, like, making videos for a little while because I've been a little busy because of Christmas, Thanksgiving, all that shit, work, blah, 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 blah. But, yeah, I'm trying to make more videos as soon as I can. And please like my video, subscribe, and thank you for watching. Love you guys. See you next time.